Hello, haven't seen you for a while. I've been busy, but I think it's time for a cocktail. And if you don't think it's time for a cocktail, you're watching the wrong channel. Um, okay, so I'm gonna do a spin on a, a hot buttered uh, rum, which I'm gonna do for Hanukkah because butter, oil, you know, all that fun stuff. So I'm gonna use brandy instead of rum, but of course you could use rum, you could use whiskey, you could use whatever you want. Uh, <laughs> that's the beauty of the cocktail. So uh, the first thing I'm gonna do is make this glass like look pretty. So I'm using a, quite a heavy glass mug because this is a hot drink. So you don't wanna be using a thin glass thing that might shatter. Use something that you would happily drink a cup of tea in. Uh, this, this is a good mug. So I'm gonna, I have a saucer of water here and I'm just wetting down the edge of the mug. And then I have a saucer of brown sugar and I'm just going to dunk my mug in this brown sugar and pat it kind of around the edge. All right, great. Looks very pretty. So I have that on the side here and uh, now I'm gonna use this brown sugar in my mixture cause waste not, what not. Put this to the side. So we need some butter because, you know, that's the hot buttered part is, well, this is not hot butter, but it's room temperature butter. That's what we need. So, you know, a good scoop of that. Depends on how many drinks you're making really, or if you want to save some for later and do it again. So, you know, a tablespoon of, or two of butter and then shove that sugar in there. making a mess. But that's okay because I'm the one that cleans up the mess. So make it and then I can clean it up. All right so I'm just going to mix this, cream this butter and sugar together like they say in the recipes. Mix it up so it's nice and paste-like. Try not to make even more of a mess than I've already made. If that's possible maybe you should be using a bigger bowl might have been helpful. All right, and I've got some spices here. Um, this is just my taste. So you use what you've got or what you like. I like a little bit of ginger. Gives it a bit of a kick. I have this cardamom. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, I love that. Add a little of that. Shove a little allspice in there. some warm and some cinnamon because why not cinnamon it's always good trusty favorite yeah so yeah so you now have this uh gloppy paste of sugar and spices pretty yummy the next step is to mix this all together in your mug. So, I'm gonna open this bottle of brandy. Finished the last one last night. Practicing for this. That's what I call it, practicing. All right. So, you want a good sploop of brandy. <laughs> you know, I would measure it, but I'm not gonna. Okay, you know, shot whatever you feel like. You can go as heavy on this or as light as you want. And then you're gonna put a spoonful of your mixture in there. Yeah. Next step is hot water. So give me one minute to go and boil the kettle. Ta-da, hot water. All right, so I'm gonna add the hot water. Mm. Stir this up. So we're gonna melt all of that butter and sugar mixture into this. Mm. Oh wow. So good. One more thing. It's one grain. So 
Whoa, okay. Who's ready for some hot buttered brandy? Anyway.